Artifact set 4 piece Veridescent Venerer. Other alternative 2 piece Veridescent plus 2 piece Wanderers. Artifact stats, sands, elemental mastery or energy recharge depending on your stats. Ideal energy recharge is around 180 to 200 percent. Goblet, elemental mastery. Circlet, elemental mastery. You can also use healing bonus circlet if you want more heals, but elemental mastery will give you more damage and decent amount of heals. If you are using elemental mastery sands and don't have enough energy recharge, use energy recharge weapon. Sacrificial greatsword or favonius sword. I prefer Favonius if you can get some crit rate from your substats. You can use Sacrificial if you have higher refinements on it. You can also use Skyward Pride. It will give you more damage since it has higher base attack. If you don't have any, the new Inazuma Claymore, Katsuragikiri, Nagamasa is a great option. If you have enough energy recharge, you can use the Wolf's Gravestone. It gives a lot of attack and it has a very strong passive which buffs the whole party. You can also use elemental mastery weapons like Rain Slasher or Blood Tainted Sword. Talent Priority, level your burst then elemental skill. Normal attack can be skipped. Level Sayu as high as possible according to your resources to maximize your swirl damage. Thanks for watching. <laughs>